Hi, it's me again with Corel Draw Tips and Tricks, and this video has very little to do about Corel Draw, but it might help you send photographs to your customer or screenshots. I, I asked a young lady to send me a screenshot, and her range had gone away, and I told her to use the snipping tool, which is inside of Windows, and then somebody suggested, why don't you use ShareX? I've never even heard of it. It's been around since like 2007. There's different versions. I just went to Google and typed in ShareX and downloaded it for free. So you could take a picture of this. You could, it's got more tools. Uh, you know, you could ask the customer like font, question mark, put it in there. And there's actually two kinds of fonts. That, I mean, I've just started using this. You can have it like that, or you can have it like that. You can highlight one word and and go like you like texas you like that font you like the size you could put a lot of stuff into your picture and like earlier today when that young lady was having trouble with her range she could go you know that's gone or of course you can't circle if it's gone but you could you know do a lot with this like well, let's get out of the pen tool, but you could go, you know, highlight hairline and say, what does that mean in your picture? Now, this program will not let me share or say this while my Snagit is running to record the video. So we're going to kind of get out of that and just go to Corel and you see this picture. And earlier today, I, I hit the, I, I couldn't find a way to save the picture, but Control Shift S is save as in, in ShareX. So I'm going to import a picture that I put into my pictures, Austin, today, just a while ago. It's a PDF. But look how clear it is. I mean, it's, it's the exact copy of my picture. Anyway, that's pretty cool. So it's ShareX. Hope that helped a little bit, and thank you for watching.